is Kim and welcome to So Little Dresses. I wanted a place to talk about dress fabrics, patterns, and ideas for little dresses. I have four granddaughters and I love to sew for them. The dress I'm going to be talking about today is the Isla Dress by Simple Life Pattern Company and the Madison Vest by Little Lizard King. The Madison Vest comes in sizes 12 months to 14 and there are so many options. You can make the crop length or a longer length. You can make a coat. You can add a hood to both of them and they have several animal ear variations you can make. There are three tie fasteners to choose from. You can choose a button loop, a regular tie like I did, or a bow. This is a size 14. My granddaughter measures a 12, but even with a 12, it's just, things are just a hair tight, and I'm not sure why, because the measurements clearly for her come out as a 12. So I went up to a size 14. I did not need to. It's a very boxy fit, so I could have stayed with the 12. I made this from a low pile fur that I had in my stash. I don't know where it came from. I've had it for years. I lined it with a little white snowflake fabric from Joann's. It's a cream color with a little white snowflake on it, very subtle. The other thing I did, I made the regular tie and I painted it with a tulip glitter paint I found at Joann's to give it a little snowy, frosty effect. I'll be right back to talk about the Isla dress. Okay, I'm back. So this is the Isla dress from Simple Life Pattern Company. It comes in sizes two through 12. A lot of options for this dress. This has a circle skirt or a gathered skirt. You can have the regular length bodice, a dropped bodice, or a curved bodice, which would make a high-low hem. You can have short sleeves, sleeveless, elbow, three-quarter long. You can add a ruffle to the sleeves. There are so many options. And they also talk on the website and on the pattern about you can combine different fabrics woven in knits. This is all knit. I've chosen the regular length waist bodice. I added one inch to the length and then removed one inch from the hem for the skirt length. And I chose long sleeves, as you can see. The bodice comes with the option with a heart cutout, and there are several other holiday cutouts on their website. I did not use a cutout on this dress. The bodice is lined, which is great for here in New Hampshire when it is cold in December for Christmas. I fussy cut this dress, which means I lined up everything on the fabric before I cut it out so that the gingerbread on the front of the bodice in the center would also line up with a gingerbread man on the back. This is a size 12, so it's a little large for this size 7-8 dress form. I fussy cut the skirt pieces so they also line up and the sleeves. I love this dress. This is fast because it's a knit. If you have a serger, this is a really easy dress to put together. The fabric is from Spoonflower. They had a sale the last week of October, 25% off. I haven't bought fabric from them before, but that was a really good deal and I got free shipping. So I've put it in my phone to repeat annually. So next year I'll be aware of that sale if I want to make something with knits. So thank you so much for stopping. Please post your dresses on the so little hashtag on Instagram and comment if you would like. I'd like to know if you've made this dress or vest. If you've used this fabric, have you used spoon, fa uh, spoon flower fabric? Uh, I'd love to hear anything about the dresses you're making. I'm always looking for ideas. I did buy a little barrette on Etsy for this dress. I'll put a picture in at the end. I hang it around the hanger on a little card and I also purchase a pack of tights at Walmart that I hang on the back of the hanger. So when I give these to the girls, they have everything all together to dress up for the holidays. Thank you so much and I'll see you next time.
Bye.